let's go. It's such a beautiful day. Why are we sleeping? <laughs> Nobody's here anymore. It's completely empty. Oh no. There's the workers. They're coming this way. This is the Ohio River. It's out there. Where's Ohio? <laughs> Are we near Where's Ohio? Like... I didn't know we were near Ohio. Uh, we're in Illinois, uh, right? Yeah, we're in Illinois. So we're, it's kind of close, but we're like in the wrong. I didn't know the Ohio River was this big. This is a huge river. It is. The, I, th I thought this was the Mississippi that we're crossing it again because it's pretty zigzaggy. Get those two big. Yeah. It's a great both directions. And then there's a nuclear. What's that? A nuclear power plant over there? What is that? A bunch of people walk in and then come right back out though. Well, because they need to be using the restroom. This is actually it though? Oh, yeah. I guess maybe it is. Okay. It's disguised as an old building. Oh, cool. Nice. They made use out of this. Cool. Where are you going? Can I. Oh, no? Bye. Oh, dude, this is a really nice gift. Give me it. Let me show them oh the bathroom. Oh, my gosh. Deep undercover. Behind Ooh, the scenes. Look at this bathroom, guys. 
really nice. I rarely show the bathrooms, but this is pretty nice. Love the flower here. Look at that. No, I think we're gonna get kicked out of here. Why? <laughs> Why? Here's a map of Kentucky. And we are here in the Paducah area. And we're going to Mammoth Cave National Park. Oh. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> Just Did it bite you? <laughs> That's great everywhere. Wait, you look different. I changed. <laughs> Your attitude? Hey, look, this is where you were supposed to park. I'm keeping it real. Look at this. Look at all those cars out there. I'm a human. Yeah, so it's over here. This is a nice welcome area, though. There's really so many um, touristy things. Oh, look. There's Jack Black. Not really. Hi. Hello. If you guys have any questions, let us know. I appreciate okay. that. Thank you. This is a really nice yeah, it's very nice. Thank you. So there's all these the, the, all these free brochures of touristy things that you can do. There's this things to see. For state reserve park. I'll just say if you guys are looking for things like uh, for Kentucky, mm -hmm. this over here is going to be for the whole state. There's nine regions. This is us here. Okay. So okay. everything is like in that region. This is the bluegrass. This is cave, like Bowling Green. We were thinking Bowling. to go to Mammoth. Yeah. That's going to be in your cave country. So Mammoth Cave Phone. Oh, okay. Yeah, great. Uh, and then we also, so they do a really cool underground boat tour, mm -hmm. which is awesome. Um, and then, of course, the Corvette Museum is there. Okay. And oh, yeah. they also have a... Uh, where you can like actually go and drive or you wow. can go with a like a, a professional uh -huh. driver but you can also drive one of the Corvettes yeah so, okay but that we do have fun. a um, <laughs> a specific Mammoth Cave little booklet over here uh-huh and then okay. this is kind of like the map for that area, so it really okay. like lays out everything, things to do, attractions, places to stay. Great. And there's Mammoth Cave, so all of these are kind of along with that. Excellent. Right. So right. That was very nice of her. I didn't want yeah. to just stick the camera in her face, but right. she seemed like she wanted to be a star, so I made her a star. <laughs> Not really. That's the uh, that's the south for you, hospitable. So, what is the history on this actual building? This gazebo here, there's a balcony. Is that a balcony? You know, it's odd because sometimes yeah, I see. A yeah, but it looks like a balcony, but there's no door to it. That that's huh? it's. I've seen those before where it. it it's like a fake balcony <laughs> for aesthetics. Or maybe, maybe see, was. look, look at this window right here. That's been, that was a window and now it's not because that's the bathroom, huh? Yeah, that's a bathroom. Yeah. That's why they uh, <laughs> blocking that out. But uh, look at the building though. So obviously there's two, maybe three stories to it. Or maybe that's just roof access up there. But it's definitely two, yeah, I'd say two stories and then a loft. But what's the historical significance of this place? I don't know. And I guess we'll never know. <laughs> I should have asked the expert. She's probably thinking, who are these clowns with the backwards hat and the tank top and... <laughs> Here's the Tennessee River. 
This is a huge river too. Good old Cracker Barrel. What day is this? Uh, first day. This is like the, the 20th? 21st. No. Yeah. How many days is the trip? Days. 21st? 21 days on the long, Since hard road? The state park is fifth. And now it's going to be five. Oh, no. I think Look at this. It's a maze to get to the restaurant. So what are you thinking about getting? Breakfast? Um, yeah, Lunch? I'm, I'm getting breakfast. Okay. Ooh, they have this Me too. too. <laughs> what? I think I'm getting this again. Oh, the cheesecake, pancake. <laughs> oh, this, yeah. this is a full breakfast. We just got the pancakes last time. Looks no, like it, you can no, get... It came, it came with that. Oh, it did? Yeah, I made sure oh, okay. some of my scrambles. Alright, here's what we're working with, the Cracker Barrel. Those are the infamous stuffed cheesecake, cheesecake stuffed pancakes with strawberries. Two eggs, Not sausages. There, but these biscuits are amazing too. Alright, she's building a bite. Let's zoom in for this tasty goodness. Alright, okay, you have one of everything in that one bite. Just tell me how you feel. Waiting for it. It's still as good as I remember. <laughs> it's like really um, fluffy and melts in your mouth. Not very sweet. Um, it just complements all the uh, ingredients. Is it, is it more pancake or more cheesecake, or it's the? Um, it's like you combo. can it's 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 combo. Like you can really taste like the pancake right. and then just the filling. It's really yeah, moist. Like, yeah, Does yeah. it have? It's, it looks like it's kind of crispy on the outside yeah. even, and then soft. I think, and, and maybe that's the only difference. Like today, it's a little bit crispy yeah, on the outside. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. good. Yeah. All right, yeah, there you take have a bite. it. Get one for yourself. To, like build it. This is not gonna go well. This is better than last time because this the is crispy. crispy. Edges. It's crispy on the outside, and it's fluffy on the inside. It's got, it's not too sweet. You can definitely taste the cheesecake. It's maybe even a little. I just said it's not too sweet. Yeah. It's pretty sweet, but it's not like, like the overwhel most, overwhelming. Yeah, it's not sweet. crazy sweet. Yeah. But uh, overall, it's, it's really still good. delicious. Yeah. So it's all yours now. All right, just to keep it real here, guys. This is amazing. Mine, on the other hand, I cannot say the same for. The eggs are really undercooked. The hash browns have definitely been sitting for a while. The bacon is really rubbery now. I'll give them a pass on that because I didn't say anything different. But the biscuits are very doughy. A little bit undercooked. Well, you win some, you lose some. The main point is that I was really, really hungry when I got here. <laughs> so, so any food was great. It's just, you know that feeling when you're really looking forward to something and you know Cracker Barrel's, Cracker Barrel's pretty good. Consistently good. Just wasn't, just wasn't on par for uh, for a normal Cracker Barrel meal. But there is a big sign out front that said "Now Hiring." So if anyone's looking, if anyone's looking for a job, come to the right come place. Come to this place right here. You get it cracking. No matter where I park, people have to park right next to me. Because they even though. Parking next There's to plenty of open spaces. Isn't that great? 
There's Tennessee and there's Florida. Guys, I love there's Cracker Barrel, but that was not it. My meal was great. It was? Okay. Well, good. Only Normally it meal. is. Normally, what is this? You have to park right next to me and give me a little sliver of a spot to get in? Hey, don't trash Papa Tennessee, man. Jeez, bro. <laughs> Look at it. It's like... Anybody in their right mind gonna park like this right next to me, but then leave all these empty spots? Like, same with this guy. All right, I'm over it. Shelter A, waiting for our tour. We're doing the Gothic Avenue tour. Um, I don't think there's really a good way to determine which tour is the best tour for you. Based on the description, they all sound great. And they are very hesitant to give any kind of personal opinion on anything, including how you should dress. Which is weird, but um, yeah, we're here, we're doing it. We're going to Mammoth, baby. On our way as a group, down to the cave entrance. <laughs> Where these steps don't count either. <laughs> Chris, do these steps count towards our Here yeah. We could explore. So we just got out of the cave. It's very cold there. And then when I came up back to the heat, boom. Fogged up. Fogged up. Even the uh, camera lens is fogged up. And my whole skin is cold. Yeah. But I made it without wearing a hoodie. You're just a cold person. Ugh. Why did you say that? 
<laughs> All right, so we just got out of the Gothic the Avenue cave tour. It's one of, I would guess, around 20 tours here at Mammoth. Mm -hmm. And we didn't have that much to go on. We chose it because it was one of the only ones left in the day. Um, what did you think? Um, what was your impressions of it? Well, it's mostly like, like historic um, tour. And yeah. It's not much like I. It's not really kind of my thing. It was it was impressive. It was nice inside, and the best thing is it was cool. It was like <laughs> air conditioned inside. That was the best thing for me. But uh, okay, yeah, like it was, so it wasn't what you were expecting. No, I was expecting like the whatever you call it, the stalactites or whatever. Stalactites like, are the ones like that the come dips, from the bottom the and. Stones. Yeah, like there were well, some they all in come. there, but it wasn't even supposed to be there. Right. But those are the ones. That okay, I so you wanted more stalactites, stalagmites. Yeah, and like a little bit narrower, you know. Yeah, less, more less, uh, famed, like man, large. less man-made stuff. Yeah. Um, less um, lights, artificial lights, and railings and stairs. Um, so it was, it was. Uh, let's see. It wasn't bad. No, it wasn't bad at all. You do have to pay. What did we pay for um, it? It's nineteen dollars. So it's nineteen each. Yeah. And it was a little dry. It was a little longer than what we needed. It was kind of a. Uh, it's kind of a. It's something that was made for the masses, that basically anyone can do. Um. So it's not extreme at all, right. which you know. I mean, stream's not even close to the, <laughs> it's close to what it was, right? It was just an easy walk in and out. Um, yeah. Our tour guide was great. I mm -hmm. think that there probably wasn't shout any question out. that he, shout out to Chris. To, to Ranger Chris. <laughs> Ranger Chris. Yeah, he seemed to know everything. Um, Very likable person. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And uh, so it definitely wasn't bad. And if you are into that thing, into that thing into like history and, history of the caves yeah. and uh, which i am it just it wasn't a lot of that to be honest and it was just very generic cave very very generic but it is big it and is, there was just it's huge the railings and the pathway and the artificial lights kind of took away from the cave experience now i think there may be some other tours that might be Better. Uh, better for us yeah. but um but that was it but uh, history wise I think that would be the people that would like history done and like simply or walks that would be their tour yeah I mean we were you know, most of the people were older yeah and you know maybe looking for something to do <laughs> yeah so so that's that all right um so right. now we're just gonna have to figure out where we're gonna stay. It's always surprising how many dudes don't wash their hands after using the restroom. <laughs> <laughs> Even after these times. Uh, is that a thing with women too, Son? Or Not everyone washes their hands. Everyone does? Yes. Yeah. So many dudes just they just walk right out. It's like at least hmm, the, the okay. women that I see in the bathroom. Dudes are gross. There was, uh, there was one lady in our group that was kind of an inspiration. How old would you say she was? I would say maybe she's in her... My guess would be... 80s? 70s. Late 70s, maybe? Maybe. Mm -hmm. or who knows? Maybe she's younger. She just has back problems. Uh, I don't know. I think yeah, she was she at least late 70s. But yeah. she was out there doing it. Getting it done. Yeah. I was she, I was there in case she uh, <laughs> fell over and uh, needed some help. Yeah. But um. She did it on her own. She did, trooper. What did you find? <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I was trying to be cinematic. Bye. Bye. Seems like we're walking back to the car again. From the welcome center. <laughs> Zen 
There are so many a deer. One right here oh, with yeah. Their, like little head. Barely sticking up over there. Uh. Oh, man. So just go slow. There's a car behind me, though. Well, just go really slow. <laughs> He's like, you want I'm some like, of this? Like, I got you. Oh man. They're so amazing. Hi. Hi. Hello. Bye bye. Do you know how to get to the campgrounds? Ooh. That was cool. They're not scared. That was better than the caves. <laughs> They're not scared. No, That's not scary. at all. There's one look right at this there. little fawn oh, over here. I didn't know. Look at look the look at the skin. It has uh, like spots. Don't mind us. Don't mind us. Don't mind us. So wow. what's in here? Should we take sure this you can if you want. Probably not allowed to feed them, but I do have cashews. Look how many there are. There's one, two, three, four, five. Then there's three more in the back. Oh wow! Oh my gosh! You could this literally walk like with deer. Way. Now we got some big birds over here. What are those things? I don't know what those are. It's not turkey. It looks like a half of a turkey a vulture it looks like a vulture is it or is that oh man i don't even know but it kind of looks like a vulture doesn't it dude i don't know these birds are territorial sometimes so beware beware can you imagine that thing just coming at you, even though it's small? Double gobble? <laughs> I don't know. Green trees, nice paved road, so relaxing. Simple things in life. Yeah.